So what we did uh, uh, at uh, our institution, in my department, uh, is uh, to try to include the next generation sequencing within the uh, workflow, the diagnostic workflow of uh, cancer patients. So we started with uh, uh, doing next generation sequencing in tissue. There are, there are, these tissue are absolutely archival tissue, the tissue we obtain in our daily practice and we run a very large NGS panels in order to detect most uh, of the uh, possibly actionable alterations in our patients. So the results of this uh, analysis is that now we are able to treat most, if not all, of our patients with on-label drugs and also we are able now to include, and this is very important from a scientific point of view, to include patients within clinical trials. So this is absolutely important because we need to test the new drugs within clinical trials and using next generation sequencing is absolutely uh, fundamental in order to include these patients in the, in the trial. The next step we are going to do and the new avenue is trying to switch from the tissue to the blood and now we are introducing liquid biopsy to our patients and for the time being according to the guidelines what we are doing is uh, testing by liquid biopsy all the patients for which uh, taking a biopsy is not phased, is not uh, uh, you know I mean safe and, and we will also uh, uh, analyzing all the patients uh, which will relapse in the future just in order to detect uh, resistance mutation. And again, this is absolutely important in order to get better care to our patients and to improve research.